some people may be interested in fasting no eating or drinking for a certain time period and I tell people what you should do is try to fast at least one day but if you can what you should do is fast for three days no eating or drinking anything and sometimes I get some people that contacts me and say that if you don't drink anything for three days you are going to die and I am thinking listen I have fasted more than one time fasted for three days more than one time and I am still here my niece she fasted not eating or drink anything for seven days seven days while working she fasted for one week while working no eating or drinking anything I believe yes yes no eating or drinking anything and she has done that more than one time my aunt my mom fasted I believe more than one time not eating or drinking anything for seven days I was two or three hours from seven days without eating or drinking anything and we are still here so when you say that you are going to die if you don't eat or drink anything for three days that is ignorance you are just finding an excuse to not do it to get what you want in God it is not going to get easy is it easy not eating or drinking for three days not really but it is worth it you are not going to die when it comes to the spiritual you can't think in natural means there are people who fast longer than seven days or more without eating or drinking and they are still alive so what excuse do you have and three days to be honest that is like average or <laughs> not even average you are not going to die do it some people contact me and tell me that they want to live for God and they tell me what they do to try to live for God and what I don't understand after all this time if what you are doing is not working why are you still doing it if doing the little that you are doing now is not working for you why are you still doing it I would think that hey let me say this and I pray that this makes sense if I was told that I was going to be tested on something and let's say I only put in a half hour in reading over the material and let's say that each time I test I only put in a half hour in reading over the material so if I continue to make an F why would I continue only studying for a half hour obviously that means I have to put more time into it oh 
So if you only fast for a day once every three years or something like that, I believe <laughs> much of the things of God is common sense. But people just don't want to do it. Obviously, you know that you have to do more, but you aren't willing. You are not willing. Put more time into fasting. Put more time into reading the Bible. Put in more time in praying. Obvious stuff. Now, for myself, I believe the reason why it took me so long and trying to live for God because I did not really want to give up my sinful life. I did not. That is why it took me so long to get to where I am now. I would always or sometimes I would get to a certain point and then when I get to that point I would go down again and it was this up and down thing. You are not going to die if you fast without food or water for three days. Now, if you say 21 days, no food or water, perhaps you may have a point. But three days, are you serious, man? Stop making excuses. If you truly say that you are willing to live for God and do what you have to, to live for God properly, you are going to do it. You are going to do it. So let me stop here. God bless you.